The Brimrose Corporation of America has become a world leader in the rapidly developing field of hyperspectral imaging systems. These amazing devices use a portion of the electromagnetic spectrum to better identify materials, which can leave a unique signature. Aided by acousto-optic tunable filters, or AOTFs, that have been at the core of Brimrose's research and development for 30 years, hyperspectral imagers are critical to the identification of unknown compounds. Here are field IS-510 hyperspectral imager, a rugged unit with no physically moving parts, tests five liquids in the short wavelength infrared spectrum. These include vinegar, gasoline, silicone oil, water, and acetone. Each organic liquid has a specific transmission wavelength identified. The video pauses briefly when each of the spectral peaks is reached. A graph of the sample's center weighted spectra is provided at the end of the video. As you can see, the spectral absorption values of the liquids vary. Here the hyperspectral imager is doing cloud analysis by a water tower near Brimrose's headquarters. Some of the clouds appear or disappear depending on the scanning wavelength. The moisture band around 1400 nanometers significantly inhibits viewing as can be seen here. Brimrose software helps interpret and understand the data, putting the customer in control. The customer can determine what spectrum is to be studied and how rapidly the wavelengths are to be imaged. The following video clip represents two important aspects of the hyperspectral image. By matching unknown vapors to known results, the hyperspectral imager can quickly identify what chemicals the smoke consists of. This ability can be very helpful to first responders or warfighters entering unknown hazardous areas. Brimrose also can provide aerial mounting for the imagers to fly through such dangerous areas. The imagers, which have no hysteresis and can operate at low temperatures, also can operate some distance from the subject and still provide a solid signature. In this case, the distance is half a kilometer. Another important element of the hyperspectral imager is laser targeting, providing a unique point for observation. Such targeting cannot be seen with the human eye or night goggles. Only the hyperspectral imager operator can view the targeting. IR sensing, for example, cannot see the targeting. Only the acousto-optic tunable filter used on the imager can provide this information. In addition to the Field Model 500 series, Brimrose also offers a 200 series hyperspectral imager for use with microscopic and general laboratory analysis. Using the Brimrose AOTF visible imager, the onion epidermis and pine stem included here are viewed under a variety of different color shades. They visibly fade and reappear depending on the spectrum of their particular colors as the imager sweeps across the visible range. We hope this has provided you with a better understanding of the Brimrose family of hyperspectral imagers. In addition to our imagers, Brimrose also supplies video adapters 
for hyperspectral imagers that can be purchased separately. In addition to Brimrose's hyperspectral imagers, the company also provides spectrometers, acousto-optic modulators, unmanned aerial vehicles, software, and other products.